Hello and welcome. Absolutely ideal weather for football here in Manchester at the Etihad. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City, and they take on Fulham. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Gundogan. Foden. Back to Haaland. Phil Foden now. Walker. Cutting infield here. Superb block. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. And so they starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And the main threat in attack today should be Erling Haaland. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, you can't watch Kevin De Bruyne and not be impressed, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner. Oh, Lee. wait a minute. They could be in here. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. 1-0 then. And he's through here. De Bruyne. Grealish. Can he make it count? And able to get a body in the way. William. Alexander Mitrovic. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Couldn't hang on to it again. Now options are plenty. Grealish. Splendid defending. Bobby Reid. Just not looking confident in possession. De Bruyne. De Bruyne. Now with Walker, not getting anxious when they have the ball. Foden, determined block. Mitrovic. And Reid with it. Palinha. Couldn't grab hold of it. In it goes at the second time of asking. And the keeper feels hung out to dry. Goal. And so the first. So back underway here into the second half. Delightful pass. Reed. Well, that would be straightforward for any keeper. Foden. Can he put them in front? Oh, crucial tackle. Brilliant. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Well, City, as the stats highlight, have had most of the ball, but it's been a frustrating performance from them so far. They just haven't had enough guile in the final third. It's all been a bit too predictable, which has to change if they want to win this one. Well, let's see if they can win the ball back and do something with it. Mitrovic. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? 
Well, Manchester City a little wasteful in possession. Pereira. And now with William. Has a go. And blocked for now. Time for a change then. Who can he pick out? Last man back and job done. Into the final 20 minutes. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Gundogan threading it through. Can he do it to take the lead? And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Mitrovic. William Pereira Mitrovic well that's how to keep the opposition at bay and the counter attack is on options available Grealish oh managing to beat him must score shortage of goals on this match 3-1 and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end opportunity it is there it is victory more or less guaranteed now Not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. And that is that full time here and a win for City.